Hey guys, what is up? It's Dusty here and welcome back to another crypto video. And today I am giving you guys a preparation video on a couple of coins which are launching within 72 hours that I think are going to be giving us some juicy, juicy gains. And you guys already know these coins have not hit the market just quite yet, but we have a pretty good track record of picking coins that do amazingly well. Having said that, guys, to make sure that even people who cannot participate in these IDOs, to make sure that everybody can get satisfied, I've thought of something. And guys, it is freaking genius. I, I've thought about this for a good little while. It is so genius. What I'm going to do, guys, is request every single person watching this right now to join the telegram down below. It is called the Altcoin Gem Information Telegram. You know why? Because guys, think about it. This is freaking, oh my, I, I really don't understand why I didn't think about this before. The more people that are in this group, the more power I guess I have to ask projects to make me host some giveaways or something. Right now, one of the problems which we see with a couple of these coins that have not launched is that some countries are excluded. Like for example, the United States, you are not allowed to buy some coins before they launch, but Sometimes there's a couple of crypto projects who give away coins, like with the tryhards, to your MetaMask, for example, or uh, with the Lovelace even, or they just give away some NFTs once they've launched, stuff like that. The more people we have, the more I can hopefully do. So I'm thinking about it now, like make sure you just join and check it out because I post updates in here about all these launches, but maybe, maybe, just maybe, I can also get some crazier giveaways going on for specifically only people in this group. So make sure you check it out. Links down below. It doesn't cost you anything. I just post updates here whenever I think there's something useful. Not too much stuff, all right? So <laughs> don't worry about it. Having said that, let's first start out with our coin number one, which is launching in a couple of days. It is called SIS. So you guys have most likely already seen me talk about this over on my channel. But guys, I highly recommend everybody that is able to, to check out Bybit right now. A link is down below and get yourself an account. And then afterwards, you can check out for yourself if you actually want to participate. But I do recommend most people to at least check out the exchange because it has worked really, really flawlessly for me. Having said that, what is the coin? It's a multi-chain liquidity enabler. Does that really matter, whatever it does? To be honest with you, just completely open and honest, no, it doesn't. It's because it's a new coin that's being launched, the price will most likely do extremely well. I'm thinking maybe another 20x or so like we saw with a couple of the other coins, but it could be the first 50x, we don't really know. There's only a case history of like three or four that have launched prior, and they've done well. So I'm already assuming just from history basis that this one would do amazingly as well. It's just, it's just simple mathematics basically. So how do you get in? It's actually very simple, but it is kind of, yeah, a lot of these things which I show you guys are like, you need some capital. You need to be involved with the platform to get in. Why? Think about it like this. These guys have $500,000 um, basically to, uh, how do you say it? Like spread over a couple of different people, right? If you want to be inside that $500,000, which is going to turn into 500 million, for example, who knows? You need to be involved with the platform. Otherwise, why would they give it to you? So people will ask me like, oh, how much can I buy for just $100? First of all, look it up because it's the same as me or you're looking it up. Just do some freaking math. Um, but also, well, think about it. Why would somebody ever want you to be involved when they could also have somebody who has $1,000? And that's why they put a max here so you can at maximum buy $500 worth. But you need to stake their BIT tokens, which has already started a couple of days ago. I've already been talking about this SAS for a couple of days now. But I'm just letting you guys know in a couple of days is launching. Uh, and, and so right now you still have time to get yourself some BIT and stake it, but it's taking the average over these five days. And so since you're starting a little bit later, you will only get the average over less days, which can be a little bit annoying, just quickly letting you guys know. But still you have some time to at least get yourself some coins and it doesn't cost any uh, basically money that you have to pay to uh, be able to buy them. You just have to stake the Bybit tokens, which I do hold anyway, so I don't really mind. And then you have to buy the SIS per $1, but I think this is like the easiest part of it all. Having said that, very simple. Right now, there's also a little bonus because for the next 17 hours still, there's a competition where if you make at least one trade over on Bybit and you use the link down below to make sure you're signed up, uh, you actually have a chance to win a couple of B Board Ape Yacht Club NFTs. So I definitely recommend checking that out. Um, so that's, that's one part. We're definitely gonna be watching the stream for that as it goes live. I think it's gonna take some time though. I think, let's see here. It's gonna go live the 2nd of December, 12 UTC. So we'll be streaming for that. So make sure you subscribe if you want an update on that. 
The second one is Operon Origins. So I've been calling this coin out for a very long while, I think like a month or so. That's because I knew it was going to get launched. I knew there was going to be proper backing because of some of the partners that they had. However, they didn't really show any progress until like, let's say about a day or four ago. That's when I made another video updating you guys about my top picks because all of a sudden they went really ham on updating the website, updating all the small parts and all the bits. But more importantly, they tuned their market cap down and divided it by three, basically turning it from a, let's say a 30x uh, potential to right now, again, a 100x potential gem. So how do you get in? Well, to be honest with you, the potential for Oprin to actually buy in is a lot simpler than for a coin like, for example, Meta VPAD, which is launching in about a week and a half from now. So what you need to do is still annoying, guys. I'm going to be honest with you. It's not so nice. You need to be on either one of these two platforms, GameZone or BSC Pad. How does that work? Well, once more, guys, it is a project backed by Bluezilla. And what they basically do most of the time is this: these projects are so extremely popular. Every single project that they launch goes times 100, 200, 300, 500, 600. So people obviously want to get these coins as soon as possible because they know it has proper backing. So the thought process there is, well, they have $170,000 to basically spread over a couple of people. Why would they give it to you, right? And so right now there's two platforms. They, they split, uh, let's say, some money on those two platforms. And, well, you have GameZone, BSC Pad. On both, you can just literally just go to the website by going to coinmarketcap.com, type it in BSC Pad here, and same thing for GameZone. Then go to the website by pressing that little button right there. And you can see all the different requirements for how to basically get in. Is it easy? Well, easy, yes. Cheap, not necessarily. So once more, it doesn't actually cost money to buy, uh, to get the chance to buy these things. You have to be involved with the platform, which in my own case here, I just paid quite a good sum of staking tokens a long time ago because I just, I just knew it was smart. But look at this. Uh, let me, let me actually go a couple of steps back. So BSC pad and, and most coins that you will have to get to basically stake to get access to these. It sounds kind of confusing and that's because I'm making it that way, but it's so simple. Let me do two steps back once more. All right, so there's a project. It is called Oprah and Origins. It is launching on a couple of different pads. How this simply works is there's two different platforms which you can buy it on before it actually goes onto the market. But to actually get access to buy it on those platforms, you need to be involved with that platform. How do you get that done? Well, in this specific case, you need to stake native tokens on the platform. To compare it, it's the same thing as on Bybit where we have to stake BIT. The same thing for BSC Pad, we have to stake BSC Pad. And the same thing for Game Zone, we have to stake Game Zone. And what does staking mean? It basically means lending out your tokens to the platform. So what are the benefits? What are the downsides? How does it work? Well, we can buy Game Zone or BSC Pad over on PancakeSwap right now. One little button, it's pretty easy to buy and pretty easy to send to our MetaMask wallet. So once we have it, what do we do then? Well, once we bought the coins, we go to staking right over there. And we basically go through this little step of staking the coins. Very simple. What do we do afterwards? Well, after you've done that, you can see there's an APY for holding the coins in there. But also, if you're staking a good amount of tokens, because guys, once more, check out the prices. And prices is again relative because it doesn't actually cost money. It basically needs you to lock up money. And there's different requirements here, which can be really high, but that's literally the only thing I can tell you. Some people will be able to use this, some people will not. But I'm showing it to you because a lot of people are grateful for it and I hope some people make some juicy gains. And what I've basically done is I, I've got a list of all the different platforms that I can stake on. I put in a lot of money, guys, a couple of months ago, and I've been staking it ever since. These APYs that you're seeing right here, the 15%, used to be like 200 or so, which basically meant I got a ton of BSC pad tokens for absolutely free. And let's say hypothetically speaking, right? Hypothetically speaking, I'm staking $200,000, hypothetically speaking. Are you guys understanding what the APY on that is per year? But that is with the idea as well that the BSC pad tokens don't really go down too heavily in price because if you look back here, have they gone down from the beginnings? Yeah, a little bit. I'm not sure exactly what the, the action was going on right there, but I didn't even get into the price. I got into the price, I think like right around, um, not sure exactly what month it was to be honest with you, but I, at least it wasn't above a dollar when I bought it. So I basically doubled my money for buying it. But also, every single time that it was a token launch on BSC Pad, I got into it for completely free, so to speak, because I already had the tokens. So that's my thought process. Uh, and the same thing goes for Game Zone. How it basically works once more is you go to the Game Zone website. Only go to these websites via CoinMarketCap. All right, Game Zone. I type it in right here. Don't go, go to Google because you might get scammed. Be very careful. 
um, and we go to the website here. This coin is not doing so well, and it's also not a one-to-one. -one. I cannot guarantee that these things will do well, but what I've said before is it's a long-term game, thinking, okay, we're getting into them now with the idea that we can get into multiple projects as time moves on, which makes it worth it, because once more, there's a lockup amount of money that you need. Um, is it worth it? Well, that depends on which exact uh, cryptos you get access to and how much, and I cannot say. But for me, it's been very worth it, and that's why I'm sharing these things. And you're, you're asking maybe, why didn't you share it earlier? Well, I did. I shared it as much, or as soon as I guess I, I understood there was a system behind it. Because at first, I've tried so much stuff, guys. I've wasted hundreds of thousands of dollars on stupid stuff, so to speak. And a lot of stuff I don't share because it didn't work. Or, or it just it was like a scam or some stuff. I tried so much stuff. And this stuff works like a charm. It's not a scam in the sense that it's been working for months and months and months. There's a very easy logic behind it all as well. So it's not really a scammy type of model or system. It's just the annoyance, basically, of, um, of having to lock up money. But again, how it works is you stake, you go to projects eventually in a couple of days. Uh, here we can already see it. So this will move upwards to projects open right now. We press it, and we basically see how much money we can buy into, depending on the tier, uh, depending on how many tokens we are basically staking. And then we need BUSD in our MetaMask, and we can just buy it by pressing one button. And a little bit later, we get another chance to buy with the first come first serve round. But there's also another thing which you can use, which is the whitelist. However, guys, you've seen me talk. A whitelist is basically just a, a potential chance to buy. A whitelist is there for almost any project nowadays, and it's just a chance that you might be able to buy if you're on that list. Not always, though. Uh, but that's always the thing I recommend you to do because it's completely free. And where we're going to watch the price action, by the way, you guys keep asking. It's called PooCoin. This is the, the website where I basically watch the price charts every time they launch. And how you do that is not by typing in the token, but you go to the freaking crypto that's launching, you copy the address, and you add it into PooCoin. You don't type it in because any coin you type in here, let's see, for example, Valhalla. Um, okay, so now maybe things have, okay, maybe they've deleted now the most of the scams. But at the start here, there's 10 of the same name. And one of the coins that's launched right now, Oprah, let's try, Oprah Origins. You can see there's already three. All of the three are fake. So you might get messed up by buying that because people can obviously just make fakes. All right, so only copy the address in there, the contract address. Uh, let's see if I forgot anything. So that's basically how you get into the staking. It's actually very simple on how to stake. The only question people keep asking me is how many coins do you get? It so depends. For example, with Oprah, there's way less people with almost a similar amount of market cap and only two platforms instead of like five, six, or seven. With Meta VPad, I think the price is going to do like times 1,000. But there's also like, let's say... 500 times more people that's going to join. So even though this coin might only do, for example, times 40, which I still think is amazing, Meta VPAD is coming right afterwards, and there's so many people joining that it's going to be even hard for me to get myself a good juicy amount of dollars. Um, because even though I'm staking so much, you only get a such amount of money. So that's kind of a bummer. And that's also why I keep sharing with people. The more people that join, theoretically speaking, the more annoying it gets because the more you have to basically spread it over. But at the end of the day, I just hope some of you guys make it uh, because it's juicy gains. And by the way, make sure you understand how vesting works. It's just all explained in here. You know, a lot of the questions that you guys ask could easily be deleted by just reading a little bit. Because uh, once you've done that, you, you don't have to ask me anything, I think. If you just read into the stuff which I've shown you, just all these websites you read, if you're interested, you'll know anything that you need to know. It's only when people just go and like, oh, okay, I want this. Let me, do, let me do nothing and just ask questions. That's when things get difficult. Read into it. Do some research properly. Make sure you do your own due diligence. And for all the people that are from the U.S. that are like, man... I watched all the way through, but I, I don't know how, well, what is this, man? There's a couple of things which you can share. One is just keep watching for my top altcoin videos because, I mean, the Metaverse coins and the Avalanche and the Terra, for example, these coins are just juicy to hold as well. So, I mean, it's not like as if we just need these. These are just things which are doing really, really well um, with like a very high percentage of success that I can kind of give you guys because I know, but it's not a... I don't know, it's a different sort of thing, I don't know. But a, a more important one, I guess, is just looking for the free airdrops. If you're in the US, I think that's one of the easiest things to get if you're completely uh, broke in crypto, for example, and you just wanna get some juicy, uh, really cheap gains. I just would recommend to just sign up to every one of these airdrops all the time. And guys, once more, just make sure you join the Alcoin Gem Information Group because I'm gonna try to get some free giveaways going. How? I have absolutely no idea. But here, for example, I, I've talked to you guys about the Chimeras project before. Uh, right now, I think they I think they're launching and are, are doing pretty well for themselves. I haven't really updated too much on them. But even right now, they, they said here, there's a Chimera's giveaway, 19 FTs. What if I could just contact them and say, hey, I want to give, let's say, 10, um, 10 NFTs away to my group because we have, let's say, 1,000 people. They might be like, yeah, maybe. maybe. So that's what I'm thinking, you know. So, yeah. That was it for today's video, though, guys. Uh, the launch from Oprah Origins is, let's quickly see here, to December 15 OTC, or UTC. And the Bybit one is going to be the 2nd of December, 
Um, we just called out the name at the start. I forgot now. Um, let's see here. The 2nd of December, 12 UTC. So it's going to be an interesting day. Two launches that day. So we're going to be live streaming both of them. I'll see you guys again in another crypto video. If you have any questions, make sure you join the other telegrams down below because we also have like a, a chat room and whatnot. So yeah, make sure you subscribe by the way for more of these updates as I try my best to give them to you guys as, as good as possible.